Thank you and welcome back to The Late Late Show with Emma Wilk. I'm your host, Emma Wilk, here with Orlando Theater star Kennedy Mason. Thanks so much for having me, Emma. Of course, anytime. So, Kennedy, how old were you when you started acting? So, I was about four. Um, I was in pre-K and the person who worked at um, my school, she owned her own theater company, so she asked me to be in The Wizard of Oz and I was a little ballerina. Um, it was it was really fun, and then I've just continued theater ever since, and it's a blast. That's amazing. It sounds super fun. So, what new shows can we expect from you? Are you working on anything currently? Yes, I am. Um, so currently, I am working on Oklahoma. I am Lori, so that should be a good time. I'm doing that at the Orlando Rep. It opens next month, so everyone come see it. Um, and. Um, I may have another project coming soon. So yeah, everyone make sure you see Oklahoma at the Orlando Rep. So um, what do you do to get into character? Like, do you study your character? Do you act in front of your friends as your character? Like, what's your routine? So everyone has a different type of thing to get them ready. Um, I I constantly go to acting classes. That's, that's key. Um, and then I have voice lessons. I have more voice lessons leading up to the show, and what I do normally before show is I really like get into character. I go over the script through the lines with someone, so that really helps. And then if it's a musical, I'll stretch, um, and that's really all I do. Um, it's really it's really helpful. That's cool. So how do you balance um, the fine line between schoolwork, social work, and theater? So how many hours are you doing theater every day? Right. So so eighth grade, I had to homeschool because there were so many shows, and I was doing professional shows, and those were during the day. But now I don't do um, those as much, and it's not as um, you know, cutthroat. So that's, it's a lot easier to do my schoolwork now. And it's normally like two shows that I do a year. Um, and they're the big ones. So it's easier now. And, um, my school is really, it works well with me. So yeah. Perfect. That's awesome. Yeah. So what, what has been your favorite show to star in? My fit. Oh, that's a tough one. Um, I would have to say Sugar Crash Kids in the Forgotten Island. That was a good one. It was written by a good friend, and it. so we did it at the Orlando Fringe Festival. We rehearsed for a couple weeks, and then we put it on, and the, basically the Orlando Fringe Festival is this festival. It's all these different, either a theater company or you know a self-written show or something like that, and you come and you watch all the shows, and sometimes the shows get picked up and then they'll go to like different festivals. So festivals in different states or different countries. Um, so it's a really good experience. Okay. And um, so that was probably my favorite and I was the lead May. So that was, it was awesome. a blast. Yes. So obviously you don't all start out a star. So how did you work your way up? Do you have any tips for any young theater, aspiring theater kids out there? Right, I say be yourself be bold and work hard. Perfect, thank you so much. Everyone, please make sure to check out the tickets for Oklahoma, link is in our website. Thank you for having me.